Halloween costumes. The October issue of Family Fun Magazine offers some helpful ideas on how to make inventive costumes quick and easy. And joining us now is the magazine's contributing editor, Deb Geigus Berry. Good morning, Deb. Hi, Pat. How are you? I'm terrific, thank you. Gearing up for Halloween. Oh, Gotta do sure. it myself. So Gotta do it. I'm sure you're gonna tell me what are some of the most popular costumes this I year. I sure am. Well, for little girls, they love fairies and princesses, Always. just like we did when we were little girls. And boys love superheroes and dogs. Those are actually the two most popular. Dogs. Dogs. Is that right? Bow wow. Yeah. Clifford the Big Red. Okay. Right. So are, are more people turning to making their own costumes as opposed to, you know, getting them from the store? That, they yeah. really are. Amazingly, half of all family fun readers make their own costumes. Is and it right? just involves kids more. It makes them more excited about what they want to be when they trick or treat. So they get involved in the making and you get involved in, and probably saves a little bit on the budget too, right? Well, it does. You can be really creative. You can go to your attic and get some old sweaters you haven't worn in a while or right. old jeans and recycle them. And we really encourage that to cut down on cost. Well, let's take a look at some of the costumes right. here today. Let's here, go. kitty, kitty, kitty. Now, this is great. <laughs> this is just a, a plain old white turtleneck with some leggings, and then you just iron on these patches, which are fleece, and you use three different colors to create a calico effect. And then her hat is just a headband, and you glue gun on a couple of ears. So it's really a lot more simple than it looks. Turn around for us, honey. She's oh, look at that tail. Meow. The cat's great. meow, indeed. That's great. just a, that's just a <laughs> hanger and stuffed it into a sock. <laughs> it works. Now, who's coming up next? Oh my gosh, it is indeed Ooh, Franken Mr. Frankenstein. Frank's monster. The most amazing thing about this is his head is a milk jug. That's you amazing. just recycle this. You cut off the the handle. <laughs> Paint it green, put a couple of bolts in, and he is ready to be electrifying. Tear up some jeans and you're good to go. Right. That's fantastic. A little green face paint, too. Non-toxic. Exactly. Okay. Right. And I think there's a fairy princess on her way. Is there a little Isn't fairy princess she in the house? queen for a day? She's great. And this is just a turtleneck oh. that's covered with puffy paint. And she's got a beautiful hat that's just made out of a cone of foam. And that lovely skirt is made of a fabric called tulle. We use three right. different colors for that. And a magic wand. And a magic, beautiful magic wand. What a wand. little star. And then that's simple. The, around the neck, you just stitch that on yes, or hot glue it if you want You don't even have to stitch it. Really? Hot glue gun it. Yeah, you, most of these can be done with glue instead of stitching if you're not a sewer and you simply just take lace and put it right around the collar and the cuff. She'll most, be in great shape. Most excellent. And I do believe that we need some raid because here comes a big old oh, bug. Ah! bug. I don't like bugs, but I like that one, Jamie. Well, this <laughs> one just starts with a simple sweatsuit. It's just, you know, a black sweatshirt and, and sweatpants and a knit cap. And you do have to stitch the wings. It's just a piece Let's of see? silver and black fabric, but it's a simple forward stitch, just like we learned in Home Ec. Uh-oh. And this hat actually <laughs> begins with a yogurt container top that you slip in under the hat, punch a couple of holes in, okay. thread the pipe cleaner through, and take it through the weave, and that's how the antenna come right out the top. That is really cool. And those are big styrofoam balls, those eyes, right? right? You just spray paint those silver and glue gun them again right onto the hat. All right, very scary, Jamie. Don't get stepped on by this big old scarecrow. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> now this one, this is incredible because most kids have overalls anyway and you're not permanently altering them in any way whatsoever. You're just basically pinning on some patches <laughs> and these little crows are toddler socks. Socks? Yeah, that you stuff with fiber filled batting and then you just put a couple of googly eyes on those with glue guns <laughs> and a few feathers and pin them on and then right after the holiday is over, Take it off and you're back to your streetwear again. Most excellent. Oh, just glue them on, take them off. Or Sca iron them on and peel them off. Excellent. Yeah, exactly. Why don't we have them all come out together? Scarecrow, call your friends. Come on, Star. Come on out and play. Come on, Miss Princess. Let's uh, see how pretty you look. absolutely adorable. Now, average time to make these? Between two and three hours. If the kids join in, make it four to five, but it's a lot more fun, right? <laughs> That's right. Oh, that is really, really terrific. Thank you all so much for joining us. Thank you. Happy Family Halloween. Fun Magazine. <laughs> Deb Geigas Berry, thank you very thank much. Thank you, Pat. All right. And still to come on Sunday Today in New York, a check on.